Now let's see this first problem. It was asked in the CBSE examination 2012. It says if the given random distribution of x is there as the probability distribution, you have to find all these three parts. So the first part asks you to find k. The second asks you to find x greater than k probability distribution or probability. And the third is here present. So let's start. I know that all these probabilities add up to 1. So the first condition is very clear. This will help me in finding out the answer to the first part. I write solution and see what the first part says. First part asks me to find k. I know that all these add up to 1. So this is 2 plus 2 plus 3 plus 1 which is 8k. Then here also there is 1k which makes it 9k. Then again add all the k square terms. So k square and 2k square plus this, this makes it 10k square and these both things add up to 1 because the sum of all probability distribution is 1. So let's take k common, so this becomes 10k plus 9 and I'm so sorry this shouldn't be taken as common indeed, let's do it this way, this will become more easier. This is 10k square plus 9k minus 1 is equal to 0. Now this is the quadratic equation. Now we can take out the factors of this quadratic equation. I know that this will be 10k square plus 10k minus k minus 1 is equal to 0. 10k taken as common k plus 1 minus 1 taken as common k plus 1 is equal to 0. What is the answer from here? k is equal to 1 over 10 because we cannot take negative values for k. So this is the answer to the first part for the value of k. Now the second part says find out the p or the probability x greater than k. So let's do the second part as well. p for x greater than 1 by 10. Now see 1 by 10 is 0 point something. So all these from 1 to 7 except the 0 fall into this category. So whatever is the uh, resultant will come from all these values. Right? So it will be again all these addition which was which we had already computed 10k square plus 9k. So this will be 10 into k square which is 1 by 10 whole square. I hope you understand it plus 9k because we have already done in the previous part why calculate again and again. So this is 9k. So this is 1 by 10 plus 9 by 10 which is 10 by 10 which is equal to 1 because all these are included in this fact. I again repeat it was probability x greater than k. Now probability x greater than k is probability x greater than this value which is 0 point something. Now what about the third part? For the third part let's make some space here and let's see how to do it. So it says probability x which lies between 0 to 5 so it will have probability where x is equal to 1 where it is equal to 2, where it is equal to 3 and where it is equal to 4. Now let's see how to do it. So 1, 2, 3, 4, these will come into picture. So this is 3k plus 2k plus 2k plus 1k. So this makes it 3 plus 2 is 5 plus 2 is 7 and 1 is 8. So that is 8k which is 8 over 10 which is 0 0.8 and that is the answer to this question. So this is how you do this kind of a question.